driver delivery training, Hi, I'm Doug Hanby, Chief Operating Officer of United Furniture Industries. On behalf of our management team and over 3,200 associates, I would like to personally thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Whether you're a driver for UFI Transportation, one of our contract carriers, or just picking up a load of furniture for the first time, I want to emphasize the important role that you play in our company. To our customers, you are the face of United Furniture. You're the person that they see on a day-to-day -day basis. And you have a huge impact on the customer relationship. Part of your responsibility is to assist in unloading the furniture. You're required to bring the furniture to the back of the truck so that the customer can put it in his warehouse. In this video, we will provide guidance on how you can do that safely and in a manner that reduces the risk of damage to the furniture. In summary, I want to emphasize the importance that you have in our customer satisfaction. Remember, as you watch the remainder of this video, that our customer's perception of how you handle the furniture carefully and safely may well determine whether they buy from us again. Thank you. You should arrive to the customer's location neatly dressed pleasant and courteous. You are the face of our company and our customer's impression of the company. Confrontation of any sort is to be avoided. You are required to bring the furniture to the back of the trailer at each stop. This is our commitment to the customer and a company guideline. We service a number of chain stores and word of mouth travels fast. So be aware of what you say and how it may be perceived by the store personnel. Most of all, remember that it takes very little time for uncooperativeness and rude behavior to get back to our offices. Each door manager is to break the seal. After breaking the seal, carefully open the trailer door while standing behind the door. Standing behind the door will help protect you in the event the load shifted and the furniture falls. Never attempt to catch a falling piece of furniture. Once the seal is broken, the door is opened and you have your two-wheel dolly placed on the dock you can back up to the dock door. Please treat the furniture as carefully as you would if it were a delivery to your home. Walk the furniture to the bottom. This will eliminate a big drop from the top and improve safety to you, which is our top priority. We require that you use a two-wheel dolly to move the pieces to the back of the trailer. If you do not have a two-wheel dolly, please ask the store if you can borrow one of theirs. Be sure to have the furniture centered on the dolly and that it is on the outside of the bag. The packaging is not designed to withstand dragging, so please do not drag it as it is highly likely it will damage the furniture. As you move the furniture onto the two-wheel dolly, Turn and walk forward to the end of the trailer. It is never safe to walk backwards as one slip will cause you to fall and the furniture to fall on top of you. If you're at a store with no dock, you will need to walk the furniture down to the ground where it may be moved with a two-wheel dolly. Do not drop the furniture to the ground. Please be careful as you move the large upholstered pieces and watch for the boxes with case goods. All of these are subject to shifting during travel. We are concerned for your safety as shifted products can be dangerous. Keep in mind the customer's perception of the condition of each piece is based on how they see you handle the furniture. The stops are marked at the beginning of each change and stop. You are to compare the style information on the bag to the pieces listed on the bill of lading. Any shortage, overage, or damage must be called in to the UFI call center at 662-447-4008. There you may be given instructions as to what to do and you will be assigned a number that must be written on the bill of lading. Without this approval number, your trucking company will be charged for any shortages or damages. You will need to be sure to get all copies of the bills of lading signed by the store personnel. Please secure the next stop with either straps or netting. If you do not have straps or netting, you can step down the furniture for the next stop to help minimize shifting and related furniture damage. Once you have pulled the trailer from the door, the store personnel manager will reseal the trailer using the seal provided to you in the bill bag for the next stop. In summary, thank you for watching this video. We appreciate you taking care of our customers. Please be safe and remember you are the image of our company to our customers.